In solving quadratic equations by using quadratic formula, the given should always be written in standard form ax squared plus bx plus c equals 0. The given here is x squared minus 3x minus 40 equals 0. So it is uh, uh, already written in standard form. Now get the values of a, b, and c. So the value of a here is 1. As you can see, the value of b is negative 3 and the value of c is negative 40. Okay, and then write the formula for the quadratic formula. x equals negative b positive negative square root of b squared minus 4ac all over 2a. Okay. Now, uh, substitute. Write the negative sign on the formula and then the value of b which is negative 3. That will later on become positive 3 because negative times negative is positive. Okay, so pass copy positive negative and then the radical sign, uh, the value of b which is negative 3 is square it minus 4 times 1 the value of a which is 1 and then your the value of c which is negative 40. Okay, so... Uh, since we have uh, two negative here, it will become positive. So positive 3 and then positive negative. Uh, negative 3 raised to 2 is 9. Okay, and then multiply negative 4 times 1 times negative 40. It is positive 160 because we have two negative. The minus sign here will become a uh, negative sign. Negative times negative, positive. That's why it is positive. So, 9 plus 160 is 169. Here, 169 over 2. Now, what is the square root of 169? 13. So, since it is a square root, it is always positive, negative, all over 2. Now, divide it by 2 or separate. We have x equals 3 plus 13 and then x equals 3 minus 13 so 3 plus 13 is 16 divided by 2 8 Neg uh, 3 minus 13 is negative 10 divided by 2 negative 5 therefore the values of x are 8 and negative 5 or the roots of the given quad uh, equation quadratic equation is 8 and negative 5 Next is 2x squared plus 11x plus 5 equals 0. So the given is already written in standard form for uh, solving quadratic equations by quadratic formula. And then next is to identify the values of a, b, and c. Okay, the value of a is 2, the value of b is 11, c is positive 5. And then write the formula for the quadratic formula which is negative b, positive negative, uh, square root of b squared uh, minus 4ac all over 2a. Okay, and then substitute. So, uh, the negative in the formula, negative. The value of b, which is 11, 11. So, positive negative, square root of the value of b, which is 11, is square it. Uh, because in the formula, we have, b, uh, we have to square the b. Minus 4 times... Uh, the value of a which is 2 and then the value of c which is 5 okay all over 2 times the value of a which is 2 and then um, solve uh, square 11 is 121 and then this one just bring down and then negative 4 times 2 times 5 is negative 40 what is 121 minus 40 it is 81 so, 2 times 2 is 4. Okay. What is the square root of 81? 9. So, it is positive, negative, 9. All over 4. Now, separate the 2. Positive 9 and negative 9. Negative 11 plus 9 and then negative 11 minus 9. Negative 11 plus 9 all over 4 is negative 2 over 4. Because negative 11 plus 9 is negative 2. Okay, and then negative 2 over 4, simplifying fraction, it is negative 1 half. And then on the other side, negative 11 minus 
9 is negative 20 because like signs add divide uh, over 4 negative 20 over 4 is negative 5 therefore the values of x are negative 1 half and negative 5 or the roots of the given quadratic equations are r sub 1 equals negative 1 half and r sub 2 is negative 5. You can exchange the two. Uh, this one will become negative 5 or uh, this one will become negative 1 half or vice versa.